Well, hello, hello. Happy Sunday, y'all. I am whipping up a new recipe. Some of you may have seen, um, I gave you two options of what you thought it would be, but before we do that, I'm going to um, make something on the side, and then you guys are probably gonna guess what the heck the main dish that I'm doing is. So I'm gonna actually whip up some potato straws. So you guys have seen me use our veggie spiralizer, which is quite amazing, yes, yes. So I'm actually gonna do it for potatoes. You know that this comes with three blades and it's got like this little secret blade in here. So I'm actually gonna use that one that we would normally use for like zucchini or sweet potatoes, um, things like that. I'm gonna put it right in the back and then I'm gonna pop it in there quickly and easily. So I squish it and then I'm just going to give it a turn so it's nice and tight, not wiggle wobble. Anyone in yet? Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's your name? Are they saying anything? Or they're Joy just said, in? hey, beautiful. Hey, Joy. Woo -woo. It's her birthday. Don't, don't inflate Yvonne's head any bigger than her. That's not true. It's Joy's birthday. Happy birthday, Go Joy. ahead. It's your birthday. Go ahead. It's your birthday. Go ahead. It's your birthday. Go ahead. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Joy. Everybody who comes on and say happy birthday to Joy. Every single person. I and Alyssa Pierce said hey. hey. Said hey. How you doing, girlfriend? I was just talking with you, your mom and mom. Linda, Beck, Linda Beck said, looking good. Hi! I'm so excited to be here. You know, I, I randomly go in on Sundays just for like a friends and family kind of one. And it's just super low-key, super like unprofessional, you know. <laughs> Brian's behind the camera. Faith left us, you know. Joy like said our, thank you. Like our other children have, right, Brian? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, so I'm never leaving. Oh, Brian said he's never leaving. Wow, that's, that's a, what do you call it? What is it? Scary? <laughs> Not scary. It's something else. Like, it's a good thing. Oh, it's I can't comforting? Think. Comforting. Thank you. Comforting. Yeah, right. That's comforting to know. Thank you, Brian. Okay. So, Brian, it's actually our anniversary in a few weeks. Right? I think it's a few weeks. It's like a month. It's like a month. What will that be? 50 years? Feels like it. But no. I'm going you to... You want to see spraying this? I'm going to actually spray this... I feel like I need way more than that, right? What do you think? Okay. Seem like it got on there? Yeah, I saw it. I need to see more. Okay, I'm pumping up using our kitchen spritzer doing a little olive oil. I could have just like threw it down, I guess. But, um, ooh, there. See, now I see it. See, Brian? I had to pump it a little more. So I'm actually using... You're going to know what this means. Huh? What? And Andrea Dean said... Hey, Andrea! Speaking of birthdays, Emma told me she wants a Color Street Pampered Chef birthday party. Let's do it. You know, I've actually done, I've actually done Pampered Chef birthday parties. Actually, yeah. I don't know if you knew this, Andrea, but um, I actually used to teach kids cooking classes for like four years. So I have done a ton and I did birthday parties. You did more years than that, I think. And I did a bunch of like, well, I did a bunch of like cooking classes kids, and yeah. camps and stuff like that. So I'm just using, um, I'm just using the, what do you call it? Should I cut them, you think? I know you're probably totally fine with having them hang out of your mouth and stuff, like when you're eating, but you know. What do you think, Brian? Does it matter? Like you said, not to me. Does it <laughs> okay. And then there's like a little butt left right there. Don't you usually eat the little last part? Not for that. <laughs> Just cheese? Uh, actually, have you ever eaten a raw potato before? Alyssa says, that sounds fun. Yeah, seriously. Super fun. We totally should do it. When's her birthday? Andrea's. Is it Andrea or Andrea? Andrea. 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 Mm -hmm. She said 8-3. August 3rd. August 3rd. Ooh, Brian's birthday is in August. Julio. Until my birthday. August. And Matthew. Ooh. And it's on a Saturday, I think she said. Oh, perfect. We will pencil you so in. So he wants friend. to book now. Okay. Well, we're, I'm going to book it. And then, ooh. <laughs> and then Aly Alyssa said, that's my son's birthday. Really? Yeah, it's a small world. Huh? Right? It's kind of cool, right? So I actually already preheated the oven to 425. I don't know, it sounded like a good number to me. And so I'm doing all these little potato. This is probably enough potato for us, huh? Yes. Just like when you do the onions. I know. We have onions but for look, like I already cut all three these. meals. Oh, we can put them in a Ziploc or something. You have to put water. Okay. Let's do water. We can eat them all day. We can have like a potato party. Boy, that'll really draw them <laughs> in. <laughs> <laughs> right? we're, we're really working for our Hawaii bodies <laughs> yeah. by having potato parties, right? <laughs> That's how you get them, right? Eat a bunch of carbs, starchy, yeah. starchy. Faith says that potatoes are good for you. I actually made sweet potatoes like this at a party, bread. Came out super good, super, super, um... We had some over there. We should have done that, huh? Crispy. We do have them. But I don't know if, I don't know if 
they bake, like it takes longer? Oh, I feel like it takes longer to bake them, but mm, I don't know, maybe it's short. Right. No. Okay, I'm just gonna do that many, because that's like a ton of fun right there. Seriously, because remember, remember last time we did when we did burgers? So if you guys make burgers, do potato straws. How fun, right? And you know what? Like, I bought a giant five pound bag of potatoes yesterday at Sprouts for Oh, is it Treva? I want to say Treva. 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 Yeah, she wants to know. She came in late. What are you making? <gasps> Can't tell. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you in just a moment. Potato You okay. may or may not have guessed correctly, Treva. Just saying. So I'm just kind of throwing a little bit more, a little bit more um, oil, and I'm going to do a little salt and pepper. It's going to come out amazing and all crispy goodness, yumness. And then this platter is so beautiful, so I can just serve it right up on this platter. This is stoneware, just like all of our other stones. So if you want to get stoned, then it's really steaming around there. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I feel like um, it, I usually spray it. Like I don't know. Like, I feel like it's I can't see it. Well, is it? Well, maybe I'm pumping it too the much. the tube? I don't think it's. It's like at the back, so when you tilt it, it's out of the. Oh, is that what I'm doing? Yeah. All right, so I'm just gonna do a little pepper, chili, salt, and pepper, which is quite we're gonna, delicious. We're gonna have a little potato with salt and pepper. No, it's super good. But honestly, if you wanted to make like sort of like potato nachos out of here, you could do that. Like put a bunch of like ground chili and cheese. Ground turkey and totally right. So it's almost like a loaded potato type thing. Kind of. Look at. I'm loving it. Right. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Loving it. Come on. There let's throw that. Throw it in. <laughs> okay. So it's is that no? I thought it was four twenty five. No, it's not. It's um right now. Okay. It is 10 after. Okay. Ooh, ooh, I think I got in the camera. But... You, you got in the camera? I think that's fine. Okay, so we're actually making woo, Cuban sandwiches. Woo, woo. And guess what? Everybody that, everyone that voted Cuban, that guessed right, your name is in here. There's only four of you. Everyone is guessing the Mediterranean rice bowls. But I don't know. Maybe I'll make that next time. That's what I'm thinking. Leanne Clark said, Hi, yay. Leanne. Leanne was at our house the other night. Did she vote Cuban? Leanne's a consultant, so I didn't vote oh. in, but she did vote Cuban. She's excited about it. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to juice half of an orange do I say and yay? pretend like this is a lime. We should have. I, I should have got my green marker, huh? Yeah, we should have. Um, I'm really hoping it's not going to make that much of a difference. But what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to oh heck to the head. Cuba said, so, "Oh yum." I was going to use this. And then squeeze it, but I think I'm just going to cut it in half and then just juice it. Yeah, yes, yes. on the fly. I'm just making executive chef decisions. There we go. So you guys know... Joy I, wants to try this recipe. I know. I want, I want, I've never eaten a Cuban sandwich, have you? But Miss Sadie and Miss Emily Sukup, the other night on our team time, they were like, oh my gosh, it's like the best sandwich ever. So I'm excited to try it out. So we're going to actually use a real juicer, like Pampered Chef Salsa Juicer. Did you all know that? So it's extra pointy, right? Like a birdie. Okay. Okay. This is a family <laughs> show. Come on. How can you not think of that, right? Okay, sorry. So it has a little rubber ring on there, and then I'm just going to so it doesn't you move around like on you, right? Perky and then I'm going to wow. <laughs> and then I'm going to juice it, and all of that juice, literally and truly, I'm not kidding, is going to come right out, Every, and all the pulp yeah. and everything. But seriously, y'all, look at this. Watch this. Remember we had the orange tree in India. Yeah. And I used to Can make orange see? juice. Yeah. It's it's like my little pumpkin. When you look at that. Like, look, look at that. Seriously. It's a lot. Okay. So we've got juice. Guys, you could just make like fresh orange juice with that. Okay. Yeah, we only need about 30 oranges to make a gold. One of the limes in half. Okay. So, no, because you're supposed to like, when you do fresh cream, you're supposed to Small do like, yeah. yeah, you're just supposed to do like one. Remember you did, remember you, yes. you did some fresh squeezed orange juice for me last week and you brought them to bed or something? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Wearing just an apron, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we got that. I'm supposed to add all this to the measure mix and pour. So that's this guy. So not just for salad, but also for marinade dressing and stuff like that, right? And then what's really cool about this is you can actually do strain or pour. So I can just pour it all in there. Perfect, right? Okay. And then I'm going to juice right in there. It does it perfectly right in there. It fits perfectly. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Watch your eye, Brian. Tip it. Yeah, yeah. I had to learn that the hard way. Ah, I knew that, right? Okay, so then look at there we go. Woohoo! Everything is out Seeds and amazing. Intact, yeah. Look at that. Isn't that cool? And I'm thinking, 
You think you could just like throw this in like a pitcher of water or something? Just like infuse it or something? I feel like I want to say that. It's more like well, it's more like tea. a zest. I'll put it in it's my more, tea. Yeah, it's more like a zest. I can zest it though too. Yeah, the skin still or the. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We have we have a zester, you know. Zester. We can zest it. We might do that. Let's just zest it now. In here, more flavor. What do you think? Okay. I usually use this for um, Parmesan, oh, but really and truly, it's for zesting as well. I didn't know what zest was before I started Pampered Chef, so um, I, I was like, what is that? Was, yeah. I was like, what's that ingredient? Is that, that fancy? Is that, that supposed to like, be fancier from zesting? No, but it puts like a bunch more oh, flavor yeah. in it. You could use this for chicken, all kinds of stuff. I know, but yeah. how come we never knew about zesting? We just weren't... I, I knew about Hamburger Helper before we got married. Yeah. That's yeah. all I knew. I knew cereal. <laughs> okay, so next we're going to put a little bit of oil. Penny Cowart said hi. Hello, hello, Penny. Oh, Penny. Penny, what did you guess? I think that was two tablespoons. You're supposed to say, Penny, for your thoughts. What Penny did you for guess? Your thoughts. I'm pretty, Penny, for your thoughts. What she did probably you never guess? heard that. I'm pretty sure she did. The next thing we're going to put, this is really crazy. We're going to put carnitas seasoning. That is crazy. Does that look like one tablespoon? Okay, yeah, it does. All right. And then we're going to put so garlic. Kick it up a notch, right? Oops, I didn't even bring my garlic press up. Oh, it's there, over there. Yeah, there we go. Well, we have a couple actually, I think, going on. Why don't you go, uh, okay. Okay. just grab okay. that one, yeah. So, um, did you know that there was two little, there was two little Barbie brushes? I noticed, yep. Well, why not? What's up with that? I know, I remember when we did, couldn't find any of them. I know, I, I don't know, hopefully it takes some ones. Okay, so there we go, there's the garlic, we're gonna put it in. Joan Estrada then... said, hi there, gorgeous. Hi! Oh, hi. oh you're talking to me, boy. Um, Were you talking to Brian or me? Jen, That's what he Jen Harris said, hello. Hey, Jen! I made it. Dan, are you at the hospital right now, girlfriend? And baby Lucy's adorable. All right, so I'm gonna take that away. I don't know how much garlic we need. Should we do two garlics? Nah. No? Yeah, let's just have it. I'm just surprised the you taste. like garlic. I've never had this, so I don't wanna. Are you nervous it's gonna be bad? I'm not a food, food No, coward. seriously. No. This is what Brian, Brian's all like, it's oh, you sure it's cooked and stuff like that, hey? Wow. Does that look yum or what, bud? What's, how's this, what's this, marinade type This is stuff? a marinade, yeah. We don't usually marinate. Okay, so Jen we got said, that going. said, no, out. going later, and thank you. Oh, super exciting. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to trim the pork and cut Jen it in half. Jen said both, lol. She, she voted both? That, I don't know. Was that, was what did she say? Both. Both? You yeah, voted both? Some people did vote both. It's one way to win. Right, I know. Yeah, she can't remember. She voted both. Well. Okay, so <laughs> so I'm gonna cut this um, pork pork loin. Um, I feel like I should get my scissors, right? Okay, so let me just take the top off here. Love to use old. <laughs> I can just see Brian's face, like really, Yvonne. You're gonna use the more stuff that I have to wash. All right. Hey, it's go. worth it. I get to get to eat, right? Right. I'd say so. All right. So you guys know I don't ever like to touch anything. Okay, so I'm just moving this away. This looks yuck. That looks okay, weird. So I'm thinking, I typically I would think you would use a I'm bone, taking the a, camera off a boning that. knife for this. Because like all this like fat and stuff what is on here. What do they call here. that? They usually call like a boning knife, but you guys can see how sharp, sharp, sharp our knife is. And look at that. All of that is coming. No, um, but what do they call it? Like silver? Or what silver is, skin. Silver skin, yeah. Yeah. So there's actually like a... Penny said, did you see my boat? A Cuban sandwich. Yes, I saw your vote, girlfriend, and guess what? You're in my bowl to win something. And I'm, you guys are going to win something pretty fabulous is because it's not even out yet. This is a new recipe. I'm not showing you any new products, but I'm going to show you this newness. I feel like I need to... We're making the Cuban. My hands in there, yes. The Cuban sandwich. Do you guys, like, I think you should tag someone who <laughs> you know that's Cuban. Seriously. Oh, come on. We need, like, authenticity in this. I'm just trying to get all this fat off as best as I can. Um, cut so, the fat? I'm trying to. Yeah, I got to cut it some way, you know? So this is probably the easiest way for me to cut the fat, don't you think? Penny said, woohoo. Woohoo. All right. So seriously, do you guys know anyone that's Cuban? Because I want to make sure that I make this right and like that Pamper Chef is on tra on, on with this and that they know. I like, guess I could have trimmed this before. You guys didn't have to see me. Sorry. But um, I'm just going to make sure I get as much off as possible. Okay? So... Um, next thing we're going to do is we're actually going to cut this lengthwise. See how, how it kind of peels like that? Mm -hmm. Okay. So we're going to cut this lengthwise. And when I did it with the bone knife, it was super easy, but I'm just trying you to do have one, don't you? Go. I don't know. I, I don't know if I have any. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this. I feel like I should a bigger, bigger knife, right? Did you, find, big, big knife did you find out how to put these videos on YouTube or can you? Or? Mm -hmm. I didn't. 
Okay, I'm just gonna go one and one. Emily okay. Gonzalez, I think it Yay, is. Yay, Emily! She said, hi, Dad and Mom. Oh, hi, love, how are you? Hi, Emily Gonzalez. Everyone gotta give Emily some props because Emily is like really pregnant right now, right, Em? And- a Couple weeks, huh? Yeah, weeks. and she's not, she's like, you know, like, you know, like if you're pregnant, you're kind of like, mm, I'm done with this now, right? <laughs> so yeah, that's how Emily's feeling. Okay, so I think that's pretty good, right? I'm sure if there's like a real chef out there, they're probably like really evil. What the heck did you just do? I know. I'm not a real chef. I'm just a pampered one. It's a to <laughs> total difference, believe me. Okay. So trim it and then do it lengthwise is what it said, right? Emily said 37 weeks. 37 weeks. Isn't that crazy? Okay. So cut it. So we're going to do it lengthwise. And then what we're going to do is we're actually going to put it in a bowl. We're going to put the marinade in there. Okay. So I'm going to actually use my small glass mixing bowl. All right. And then I'm just making sure I'm not I'm doing anything right. Trim the pork. La, la, la. Um, it says la la la. Yeah, place the pieces in a medium bowl. Okay, this is a small Penny bowl. Penny cooked actually. her first roast onions and carrots in a quick cooker today. <gasps> I made that last night. Comfort food. Wow. Oh, sorry. Okay, so there we go. It said medium bowl, but this is a small bowl. Does it matter? I don't think so. Okay, so we got that going on. Next thing is I'm going to throw a quarter cup of the marinade. So, like, how do you even know what that is? I don't know. Oh, we have a little margarine <laughs> bar here. Okay, so I'm gonna go. So this is the kind of stuff I usually mess up on. Mix her up a little bit. More. Trying really hard to not mess it up. Okay, so we're gonna do a quarter cup, and this is really cool because it has four different recipes on here. They're actually like We've low done them all, low fat too. Oh yeah. So quarter cup. It's about all of it. I know that's totally all of it. Did I mess it up? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, well, we'll make more if necessary, right? Okay, so there we go. We're going to just pour it over. Does it not look good already, right? Yeah, it looks... I think we should might as well just put all of it in there. I don't feel like... How can we barbecue it, huh? Don't you think? We are. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to grill it right now, but on in the inside. Grill. Oh, the oven was for the potatoes, huh? Hmm? The oven was for the potatoes. Yeah. Okay. I think I'm just going to go for the whole shitty. Don't you think? Amanda Nixon said, Quick Hi. cooker is amazing. We use it at least three to four times a week. Oh, yeah. It's it seriously has changed our life in the kitchen, you know. All these tools. You've have. said that a few times. I know all the tools have. It's crazy. Stoneware did that. My grill pan did that. Rock rock or the yeah rock rock rock, yeah. rock rocks rock. The warmer thing. You know yeah, we got we got it going. So I think that's good. What do you think? How's it look? Right. Get a good shot in there. It looks real. It looks like a yes. real chef is. Okay, so basically, um, I am going to cover it, and yes, this is my ice cream. Is that why the ice maker. cream always tastes a little savory? No. My ice cream maker um, lid because I'm pretty sure mine's under someone's like couch or something somewhere. So it says to marinate for at least five minutes. Okay? At least five minutes up to 30 minutes. I'm pretty sure the longer you marinate, the more amazing it is. But we don't have a lot of time right now. We're just like, let's do it. Right, Brian? We're salt okay. and peppers too. We like that. So we oh yeah, how can there's a salt and pepper? It's kind of weird, huh? Okay, so then it says to do that, and then we're going to get this, we're going to heat the nonstick pan, okay? So you guys know my favorite pan in the world, yes, yes, mm -hmm. double grill pan, all right? So we're going to actually heat this up with the presses in it, and just so you know, you can use double grill pan, single grill pan, any grill pan that we have. Um, oh, there's water in there? It might have been a little bit of water. Clean, wash. Okay. So three to five minutes. Get it hot, hot, hot. Feeling hot, hot, hot. Mm -hmm. Feeling hot, hot, hot. People in the party. Hot, hot, hot. People in the party. Hot, hot, hot. They come to the party. Know what they got? Are you supposed to say that part too? Okay. okay. Come yeah, on. Let's, okay. Let's, All right. Anyway, so you're gonna do focus. it for about three to five minutes, and then we're gonna cut the remaining lime in half. Which is their second one is somewhere. Go it's here. supposed to be like this. Our remaining lime. No, it is. I, I put it on the side um, Oh, purpose. our remaining lime. It's a lemon. Oh, lime. I get it. Sorry. Okay. Emily so G said hot, hot, hot. Thank yeah, you. You know it, Em. You grew up listening to... I'm just going to use this corner right here because I didn't use that even though this is a bread knife. You know, whatever. Okay. So we're going to do it like that. Look at this bread knife. How amazing. It's oh all serrated. Oh my gosh. It's insane. Nice, I mean, it's right? Like, Super, super sharp. Okay. I cut leather with that thing. I've cut metal. <laughs> no, you haven't. Rubber hoses for the cars. <laughs> you yeah. better not. Okay. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to get that ice and hot and we're going to do that for five minutes. And then we're going to put, we're actually going to put the lemon down, line, down in the pan. We 
you've done that. So then it gets like, you know, like yumness going on while you're cooking. So it cooks in the juice. Kind of a mulse or some kind of, I don't know. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's like a culinary thing. Yeah. Pretty sure. Okay, but I'm going to let that ride for just a couple minutes. And while that's happening. Emily said talk more about the knives. More about the knives. The knives are are incredible. They have a lifetime warranty. Is that? Is that? Lifetime. Look on the other side of it. No, that's pork in there. Yeah. Yeah. So it had, they're triple riveted. The blade runs all the way down. Full tang. Is that what it, Full tang. Yes, yes. Lifetime warranty. I mentioned that. So super amazing. Nice. Love them. Love them. So I'm just going to make up the uh, the goodness here. We're just going to slosh this in another bowl. Okay. We're you want to tell people what slosh means? Slosh just means like <laughs> put it in randomly, however much you want. So <clears throat> I don't even know how much it calls for. So oh heck, do they have my hair? You could write your own cookbook. My hair You should. Shit. With slosh and scoosh, I don't know how much slosh, eat. goosh. I just told, is Joan on still? Oh, probably. Hey, Joan, I just told, I said cracker. She said, I, something <laughs> happened and I go, cracker. And then she's like, is that like a Southwest thing? And, and I said, I said, no, that's, um, that's an Yvonne-ism is what my husband calls it. And so I know, I'm getting like more gray hair. It's crazy. I don't know. It happened when my son moved out. It's been going down now ever since then. All right, so I'm gonna put, I don't know, two tablespoons or something. So this is actually Dijon mustard rub. Dijon rub. You wanna hear what your daughter? Yes, did. I wanna hear what Emily says. Yes. I made raspberry lemonade today in the pitcher. Mm-hmm. Quick stir pitcher? And guessing. juiced like 10 lemons in sure, sure. five minutes. No way. Did you use, which one did you use? With the you citrus, use the juicer or citrus, the citrus press. Citrus press, super fast. So quick, thumbs up. Right. And use my PC knife and cutting mat, of course. Yes. And then Penny said you could go you you could go live in Georgia with the way you talk. <laughs> <laughs> well, sometimes people because I say y'all, they're like, Are you from Texas? I'm all no, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> like, so I don't know. I don't know where these things come from. Was it been five minutes, would you say five ish? Three three or five, yes. Yeah, it says at least five minutes to marinate it. We're good. I'm not good at marinating, but you know what's really cool? You could actually do this like before you go to bed at night and then put it in for the next day. Yeah. Right? Wouldn't that be good? Well, okay. I mean, we've marinated stuff overnight. It's, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. To me, it's like a fine right? line on the difference, you know? Okay. I'm pretty sick. I'm sorry, I just want to make sure I'm doing this right. What, okay. t- tell people what you say about me. Like, I'm what? just as happy. <laughs> oh, yeah, Brian is happy. Brian, Brian is happy. With a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Just as happy if I give him a peanut butter and jelly sandwich or if I give him filet mignon. He's like, oh, yeah, cool, that's fine. He's very simple, which is good because when he first married me, I was like, did not know how to cook at all. Were you right, the burn right? queen? Yeah, I was like, him burn queen. Okay, so here is our pork. I'm going to throw it down on one side here. Yeah? Does that look good so far or what? Yeah. It looks like it got in there. I can see like the color is different. So. Can I say pour some in? Well, it'll just cook. Alright. Ooh, it smells well, so just, good. Yeah, right? Wait can you till you cook it and then put some on the other side. You know no, I mean? can't because this is marinated. It's in raw, so you have to use it now. It's okay, though. I'm just going to go for it. Yeah? Doesn't you that look good? Same, huh? Yeah. Doesn't that look good, though? Yes, it looks yummy, yummy. yummy. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to cover it up here. With the press. And you just do about four minutes on each side. I don't know if you have to cover yeah, the... Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what? It might speak the juice out. Right? If, it, if it'll... Well, it's not really heavy. Look, it does It is a moon shape. You know what I mean? Mm-mm. Pretty good. What do you guys think so far? You guys got a holler. Give me your thoughts. Tell me, tell me. I feel like I should make more of that marinade stuff. Oh, oh wait. Bro. Oh, we do have to. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Um, okay. So we're heated up. Penny said I can almost smell it. It smells super good. Um, so we add the pork um, to one side of the grill, cover with the grill press, add the remaining citrus half on the other side, grill for eight minutes, so we're going to flip it halfway through, so we're going to, someone be my timer, tell me when it's four minutes, honestly and truly, okay, and then we're going to transfer that and we're going to chomp up the pork, okay, we're going to chomp it up and then we're going to cook up, we're going to put it in the bread, so I'm going to start doing the bread stuff right now really quick, and then you guys are going to get the gist of it. But the other thing I have to do, and I'm sorry, I meant to tell you to open this before your hands were. Can you open Karen it? Karen Sasso said, yum. Hey, Karen. Karen, what did you What did you vote? I know you voted. You voted, didn't you? So tell me, tell me. So I'm going to use our quick slice real quick. Real quick. And I'm going to put these pickles down, and I'm going to do them lengthwise. We like pickles, right? It's the bottom? Oh, yeah, it's on there. 
Yeah, it's on there. We like we like. Yeah, it's link. Right? Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm just grabbing. Well, they call them sa sandwich cut. Well, or, yeah. you know it's funny because they have this. They have the ones where you can buy them like that. But this one was like way less expensive, so I was like, I'm just gonna get this big old giant one for like 23 cents more. Karen said she voted it. sandwich. Oh yeah, you did, Karen. Oh, I'm gonna put your name in there. Okay, so look, now you've got all the slices of the pickles. So you can use this for tomato, for cheese, you can do all kinds of stuff. And then this is the yummy goodness. Whenever I make paninis or anything, I use mayo, and then I just do one of our seasonings. It doesn't matter which one, and I don't know why, but it comes out. It's like, it like kicks it up like six notches for, for a, um, a sandwich when you've got, what do they call it? I forgot what they call that when you do that. You guys remember what that's called? What's that called? When you do what? When you put like mayo with seasoning on a sandwich, like aioli or something like that. Oh, yeah, I know what you're saying. I think it's something like that. Okay. Karen, did you, Karen, oh, I'm going to put Karen's name right now because I missed that, Karen. I didn't think that you voted for it, right? So check out those ciabatta breads. Those look yum or what? Those look super yum or what? You guys make sure you're timing me because I need four minutes on there. We're gonna peek at we're gonna peek at our potatoes real quick. Woo! Look at Brad. Can you see? Yeah. Emily said a a i a oleo. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh, look at Brad, you gotta see this. Do we really want to see? Can you see? Oh, does that look good or what? Yeah. Yum yum. Right? Penny right. said I love the Greek seasoning. Oh the Greek, Greek rub, rub or whatever. Yeah. yeah, Greek rub's super good. You know what I love is the um the bell pepper herb rub, super good. What do I love? Um, I don't know. Oh, what? Oh. I don't know what The barbecue. Oh, barbecue. Yeah, I love barbecue too. Look at it. I think they should go a little longer though. What do you think? I do too. Is there any right. way to like kind of toss them around? Yeah, or? that's what I'm just going to do. Tongs or something? We're just going to get our baby tongs here and we're going to toss them around. Ooh, yeah. MYG said ciabatta, ciabatta is the best. You know what's so funny? I never liked ciabatta before. But then I had it like recently and I was like, man, this, this is actually pretty good. Right? Yeah. I don't know how, I don't really remember seeing ciabatta bread, you know. Well, I'm pretty sure like ago, when Jack in the Box came out with it, then yeah, everyone knew about it. Yeah, kind of popular. Right? Seriously. Doesn't that look good? Looks yummy. Do I need to put any more oil? That's good. I mean. Do you want to just drizzle some for me? Yeah. Just open up the top a little bit. There. Just gonna drizzle around. I don't know if we need it. I just feel like we should just. Am I showing the trash here? No, because this is over. Right? Yeah. I think we're pretty good. I don't know if we need it, but we're just going in there. We like them really crispy, right, Brian? Yeah, we do. Is yeah. anyone timing me for the four minutes? It's gotta have been close to four minutes. Four minutes? Your lobster's claws closed. Yeah, lobster. Someone told me to make um, lobster in the quick cooker. Let's go bring that aircraft in. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, people. Yeah, think you guys are like driving in traffic. Penny said, Is that onions pot. or potatoes? It's potatoes. Potato. Yep. Spike with this. We did it. See, we did it. Yeah, we did it with the veggie spiralizer, right? So, um, so we're going to assemble. Leanne this said, One more minute. Okay. One more minute. Thank you so much. But Leanne. Penny said, Yes, four. <gasps> oh, she's, I think she said, Yes, I'm supposed to do it for four oh, minutes. Yeah. Leanne saying, One more minute equals four minutes. Is that what she's saying? Okay, so we got that going on. So I'm just going to go ahead and... Uh, what did I use this for right now? I'm going to go... The oh, orange or something. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this is already... It's already, already sliced. There we go. But you know what it says? It says to take the inside, some of the inside out. Right? That's hilarious. Okay. Yeah. Look, it says take some of the inside out. Yeah. Got it. Huh? I don't know why I want to eat that. Do you want to eat it? I don't know if you want to eat and talk. Just put it to the side. You can... This is my problem. I want to just eat this right <laughs> Man, put it down. Put, this is why step away from the... This is why I don't have... I'm not going to have a Hawaii box. Okay, Leanne said it's been four minutes. Okay, perfect. All right, I'm going to give it a... I'm going to give it a flip. Give it a whoop whoop. Yes, we're going to give it a flip. Look, at, I think that's how you do it. It's not both... Should I put it on both sides or just one side's probably good, right? I think one's good, yeah. We, okay, maybe we can add it if we... Okay. All right. Okay. So let's flip. Oh my wow. Looks like they're cooking, huh? Right? Oh wow. Does that look good or what? Mm -hmm. You guys, if you guys could smell this, seriously. Seriously. Look at that. Yum. Am said I made huge hash browns in the nonstick skillet and cut it in pieces. It was just like the ones like in the restaurants. I'm gonna take these out because I think I have to um juice these. Now, that sounds What's that emoji? Good. 
It has the um. Are you drooling him? Is that what that emoji <laughs> is? They have a drool emoji? Yes, they have a drool emoji. I use it quite often actually. I bet you do. Okay, so assemble. I feel like I'm missing something though. Heat the pan, oh yeah, we're going to wipe off the pan. But it says to squish this on each side of the ciabatta, Brian. Leanne said I'll be right over. Each, she is close to Brian. Shirley oh. Villex. Hello, Shirley. So I love that you can hold the pan forever with your silicone mitts, oh yeah. Right? And Mona said... Mona, Mona, Mona Esperanza Hernandez. Oh. Esparza, yeah. Esparza? Esperanza. Did you? I don't know. What I that looks so amazing. We need smell of vision I don't know if you do want that because you will be. I know. I think right? you, yeah, it smells. Mona, good. you quit, you voted for this. I think you're in. You're in my. You're in my bowl to win, girlfriend. You're in my bowl. So I'm just gonna <laughs> scooch this stuff on here right now. Right? People want to be in the bowl, huh? Yes, you want. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, I'm almost. I'm almost. I'm just taking it off the top. It said to take some of this stuff out. Is that off the top or the bottom or both? What do you think? I think the bottom. Just one side's good. Right. I think so too. All right, so I'm just gonna squoosh like Mona that. Said, yay! Yay! How <laughs> the heck are you, girlfriend? Okay, there we go. Yum. Mm, smells good. Sorry, I know. I, I are you getting lost say, in a? I hate to say that I, <laughs> it smells good because I'm like, you guys are like, really? Does it smell good? Or she's just saying it smells good. Like, who knows? Right? But no, really. No, you've got a good smeller, and if oh, it yeah, wasn't good, she'd be letting you know. Brian, Brian knows I have a good smeller of, for all these years. <laughs> That's all we're going to say about that. Yeah. Right, Brian? Yeah. I can smell anything. I, ha I can't see it, I can't hear, but I can smell really good. That's what I would say. That's like my sense, right? You're yeah, that's your special. What yeah, do you that's, call my, it? that's my... What is it called? Um, what do you call that? Like, you know, like your... Mm. Superpower? Superpower, yeah. That's my superpower. It's not. It really hasn't gotten us very yeah, far. Really, I know. It really hasn't. But at the same time, it is helpful. It, it would be if there was like a fire. A gas leak or something, yeah. Right? I, I'm pretty sure I've, I've, had, I've smelled gas leaks before. <laughs> Dutch oven. Okay, let's see. All right, I've made three now. I'm pretty sure if I keep Sylvia it, said, I'd love, love to see you using that pan. I haven't used mine yet and need motivation. What? Emma how, said heightened senses. <laughs> how, can you, how can you not have used it yet? Brian, I feel like I'm supposed to do something with this. Drinking my energy juice. One of the other juice. Blah, 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 and he's blah, blah, blah. laughing. Laughing Trim faces. the pork. Place them on the meat in the medium bowl. Put the marinade in there. And let them refrigerate. So we said LOL. Kept them remaining half nonstick. I, I'm sorry. I, hate, I don't like when people do this typically. <laughs> Add the pork to one of Andrea, the things. Andrea, Andrea, like, love the gas leak comment. <laughs> Combo. Yeah. Turning fork halfway. Even through. though our house is electric, we still have yeah. gas leaks. I don't know uh, yeah, our house is electric. Let me just say. Transfer the pork to the medium bowl. Chop it. Carefully juice the grilled and add it to the pork along with the remaining marinade. There you have it. That's what it is. Emily G said you can smell the good restaurants before we pass them on the street. Yes, that is a plus, right? Okay, so here we go, you guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other one. So there's the other orange. Prepare to be amazed. I'm gonna put this in my teeth. Just drop this whole thing in my teeth. What do you think? Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. See? Oop. Right? Okay, look at it. That's what I'm doing. I'm putting it in my teeth. I don't like to waste things. If y'all 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 have seen my stuff, you know I don't like to waste things. Why do pickles make you salivate? Is that like a okay, don't you, I'm are you not salivating? Are you You just really like pickles or something? I guess. I mean not more than Is anyone else when you have pickles or even just see them or or see them come on guy how's that possible and what you said yum right you guys have to read my timer on there oh and i think it said to put this in there too the hot one the caramelized one really you guys if you want to make just like lemon chicken seriously put lemons and, and squeeze some afterwards over it's amazing so there we go yes this looks fab or what? Look at Our that. Emily said weirdo. Who's a weirdo? I'm a weirdo. The pickle thing? Yeah, pickle thing, probably. She's That's why you always want pickles when you come over here, huh? <laughs> she wants pickles because she's pregnant. And exactly. he said, try three sons, one son-in-law, <laughs> four <laughs> grandsons, <laughs> lots of gas. If you can only, always, some find a way to... It's always boys, right? It's boys. It's a boy thing. 
Boys are stinky. Sure. Just the way it is. All right, we're gonna do a little more public in here. <laughs> Leanne said it's been over four minutes. Oh my gosh, okay, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Leanne. Have you seen my little Barbie brush anywhere? <laughs> Emily's laughing out loud. Yeah, because Emily's living with you, that's why. All right. Remember let's go. Jacob's room, Emily? But that was a gas. That was just like boy, like sweat smell. Don't you think? Was there anything else I was supposed to put in here? It seems like, oh, the seasoning. Emily said potatoes. Oh. Oh, should I check the potatoes? Yeah, potatoes. Let's go. They're probably burnt one. I have a weird feeling that they got. Are they burning? I think so. Okay, sorry. We're talking about gas way too long. All right. No, they look good actually. Oh, nope. You're going to tip the whole oven. Look at it. Is that gap that big before? Yes, Brian. I don't think so. Brian, that's I saw the whole, well, you'll see on the replay, the whole oven like rock forward. Right, that's always like how it is. That's how it's supposed to be. Nothing wrong with it. No, it was not that. There's nothing wrong with it. I clean, I know, I clean it. I don't You clean the oven? I clean this top, the stove oh, top. I find it hard to believe. Okay, so look at this. Ooh. What do you think, Brian? I remember that big gap. Okay. Brian, it always Emma, can has you see that, that gap. Do you see that gap? Yes, you... that's how that's how all ovens are. Every everybody look at your ovens because I'm pretty sure they all look like that. I see a lot of ovens in my day. Okay. This looks good or what? Oh my god. Where do you put that? We're gonna put it next to the we're gonna put it next to the sandwiches and eat it. Next time we'll make wedges or something. Why? I like these. See something go by? I heard something. Did you? Was that your phone? Keep moving here. Let's go. All right. Okay. If you guys if see If Leanne says there's gaps, then I believe. See? <laughs> she, it's, not, it's true, right? Karen said that her gap is that big, too. I, I don't know why. I mean... Everyone's got gaps. Maybe it's this angle. I never well, noticed. You guys know I have I have a big gap because in my, in my teeth. Right? <laughs> Charlie Pride. Does anybody know who Charlie Pride is? Wow. Huh? That is so mean. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> the answer, LOL. Oh, I, I'm not LOLing it. It, does, it looks kind of funny. If anybody just like joined in right now and see all my gaps that big. And <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you're <laughs> Yes, there are that. gaps. Oh, shoot. Okay. So we're going to chomp this up now. Yes, yes? All right. We're going to take this off. And we're going to chomp it. So how does it look? Maybe does it, it seem kind of... No, I don't think so. Does it? Does that look good or what? Okay, we have to put the sandwich back on here, though. Well, you wanted to pour all the juice. Huh? You wanted to pour all that. I'm seriously like... Emily said you rocked the gap. Thank you, Em. Okay? So I think I'm supposed to pour it on you. I think. Gosh. All the Charlie Pride I listened to growing up, and I can't think of one song. Well, I'm glad. It's super mean, Brian. Charlie Pride was cool. Oh my gosh. It's very juicy. Well, you just even put more juice. So yeah, it's gonna be juicy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Juicy. Mm. Can you guys see this yumness? Love Charlie Pride, that's right. Do you know Treba, the song? Treba? Because Brian wants to hear it wants My song. mama's favorite song was Kiss an Angel, Good Morning. Do you know that song, Brian? Yep. He was also a man, I must say. Well, mom definitely. Yeah, exactly. Was. She doesn't look like a man, but if you just take her teeth. It... This, this cooking show is gone <laughs> a, a far. All right? Yeah. Like, literally. We'll give away our age if we confess to knowing who Charlie Pride is. <laughs> I, know, I don't even know if I know who Charlie Pride is. Brian's much older than me, just to let you guys know. Yeah. How much older? Brian's hey, like. Hey, it's not much. You had the Brian's like complex. You had the daddy complex going on there. Had to marry an old. Shut up. <laughs> Seriously. Seems like when we were younger, we, our age was closer. I don't know what happened here. Yeah, I don't know. Well, hey, Brian gets... I'm just, I married Brian because I knew he could get discounts like five years before me. So, I'm just working that this year. Working that angle. Right, Brian? Okay, so I think that's what Finally, I'm starting to earn my right? worth around here. Look, it has that look. Did or what? Man, that looks really good. Man, I right? took the camera away for a second. And You're I both old. It's okay. Wow. What happened? Our daughter said you're both old and it's okay. Or it's okay. Okay, so you gotta check this out, Brian. Seriously. So just wiping off. No, yeah, because they said, they, and I did it too long, obviously. I so Brian said he's about he's a bit before my time. <laughs> Say seriously, it says to wipe it off gently. Man, you guys can see women. how easy this pan is to clean. So encouraging. I'll never do this again. What? Anything you stuff here, Brian? 
Oh, don't be mean to Brian. I need him, y'all. Okay? So, look. Yo, after the live, you can say whatever. <laughs> so, Faith gets back. The this cooking everyone show has gone awry. Yep. <laughs> <I didn't know. laughs> now you need your own show. Look at We always say that. We always say that. We, we tried to we get want, some YouTube thing our, going. But we we want to do our own show, huh, Brian? Call it, and we want to call food fight. Because <laughs> Brian and I tend to argue. I know, it's weird. That we really Look haven't it. Isn't fought. that crazy, Brian? It comes right off like that? That's kind of crazy. Oh. Okay, now we're going to put the ciabattas down in there. Yes, yes. And then we're all done. Yeah. Okay? Yum, yum, yum. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the cheese first. And what is it called? Muk, mukbang or something? Have you heard of that? What? Mukbang or... Someone probably knows on here. Mukbang. Penny said having fun. It's like food. Like people eat food on... It's weird. It's kind of review. It's usually like review. On YouTube it's usually re like reviews, food reviews, but some people are just... I don't know. It's like a YouTube thing? Yeah. Like, yeah, it's a big thing. Mukbang or something. What? Really? Yeah. I never heard of it. I don't go on YouTube that much. I need to. Yeah, you're... That's one of my goals. Why don't we finish live, right? See if you can if you can save it versus share it. Love it. Food fight. Oh, oh, yeah. I know. We keep saying that we want to do that, huh, right? Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to assemble the sandwich, slice it about in half, remove some of the interior bread, combine the Dijon, Dijon and mayonnaise, Dijon. and spread on each, each side. Layer the bottom. Watch. Well, I'll show you how the food cheese. fight comes into play here. Yeah, cheese, Dijon. pork, ham, pickles. Does anybody there have any Dijon in their fridge? Seriously? I'm going to Dijon you in a second, and you're not even going to get any of this. How about yeah. that? Okay. I'll take anything. So point. there's our pork. Be quiet. And then we've got ham. Can you help me with this? I forgot to open it. Emily G said new words, LOL. Dijon? Just new pronunciations. Dijon. Brian John, can you open this, please? <laughs> yeah. I have a phone in my hand. Okay, here. I'm going to do one side. You do one side. Can you do it? Can I do it? Yeah, can we help go. you? Watch the. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna. Whoa! There you go. And that's how we've made it. This. <laughs> that's how we've made it this long. <laughs> I don't know how much ham it costs for, but I'm pretty sure I just coughed on it. this one's yours. Just kidding. Oh. Okay. Then I'm, put, <laughs> then I'm gonna put. This, this. guy on YouTube, he's, he said he was like coughing totally. I mean, like coughing fits. And he goes, I don't know what I got, but my grandson literally sneezed right. In my mouth. He goes, my mouth was wide open and my grandson sneezed right literally into his mouth. Nah. Yes. Okay, so look. Emily G, people are saying teamwork. Right? That was, seriously, that was pretty good. Don't you know Emily G, so that was amazing. I know. See? I don't know about amazing. You know, your, your firemen, your, you know, your police officers, they're amazing. We're just. <laughs> We're just regular people up yeah. in here <laughs> doing amazing things. All right. I don't know how much it calls for. It actually was kind of amazing. It kind of was. I, I, I'm kind of impressed with this. All right. So hey, whatever. Whatever. whatever works. Whatever works. See, Faith isn't here. Who knows what we do when Faith is here? Ooh, yeah. Don't tell her, everybody. Don't, yeah. let, don't let Faith know. Yeah. We're having fun without her. Yeah. Look at That looked good on my Yeah. I'm feeling Cubano already. Okay, Brian. I'm going to have to do my seriously, we're gonna Havana, have, we're, my seriously, Havana dance. Like, you already know that I want to eat, like, a bunch of these. Emily said I couldn't do that with two hands. <laughs> I know. Because you Penny said loving this live. They make it. Who, who said that? Would you subscribe to our YouTube channel yeah, if we did? Yeah, tell us. Come on, everybody. Give us a little feedback. Yeah, come on. Oh, shoot, shy. Oh, shoot. Did I just drop on the ground? Yeah, where's that dog of ours? We don't have one. Oh, right. She's gone. Are you talking about Faith? No. Oh, no. Kona. Our dog. Kona. Our dog. Kona. Poor Kona. That's a sad story. Oh, no. She was only four. She was only four years old. I literally was Penny like, said definitely. They watched Thank it. you, Penny. All right. Penny, that's one. Penny's so awesome. Penny is Penny's a rock star. Emily she, said you She like famous. totally supports me. And you would know us, Em. And we'd have you on as a guest. Yeah, Em. You can be a guest on our YouTube channel. And Leanne said, of course. Karen said, for sure. Oh, hey, thank you. Now make the other recipe. Yeah, we'll do it on YouTube, maybe. Yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah. It looks awesome I think on Google. I have like so three many. subscribers you can on YouTube right now. But I don't like putting anything on there. So it's like, why would they subscribe to me, you know? Right? One okay, one more time. Is it Andrea, Andrea or Andrea? Andrea. Andrea. And Andy. What did you say? Andrea. Oh, okay. Andrea. I'd subscribe. Name it. This cooking show has gone has gone right. Right. <laughs> yeah, that's a good. Or cooking with gaps. <laughs> wow. Wow, you're creative. There. That's good. She's we'll we'll go creative. to you for the name for sure. Yeah. She's Deborah super, she's super creative. Said yum. This looks good, huh? And. 
Joanne said, mmm, this looks yummy. <gasps> Emily said, cooking with gaps. And she's totally you laughing. Gaps, faces. Seriously, come on. That's like totally mean. <laughs> that seriously is mean. So we should start calling it Yvonne Gaps? Hey, Gaps. Wow. <laughs> I don't want you guys to come up with a nickname for me. Yeah. I need that yeah, seasoning. Yeah, this is why Brian's behind the camera. Yeah. I need that seasoning and that sandwich. No, really. Right? That it was Gloria. Good. You really? No, seriously. Hey, Gloria. Hey, you know what? Hey, who has ever like had like a real Cuban sandwich? Because you guys, I never have. So it's like, tell me if I'm doing something wrong here. I'm following really, what Mom? Pepper Chef says. No, because they might say, oh yeah, they put more pickles or something like that. I don't know. You know? Emily said new nickname. That's horrible. I know. Isn't that terrible, Emily? I shouldn't talk to your mom like that, huh, Emily? No. Thanks, Em, for backing me up. You're, Em's the one that said cooking with gaps. Wow. Okay. Seriously. Okay, how many can we I'm sure Em... Is it we new can Nick? probably oh, eat, okay. like, all of them, but... I what, wait, are we having company? No, we're not having company. But, um, you we know... Ne we never have company. No. Okay, so no. how does it look so far? Say, say, Sadie said... Hey! No, okay. it's good. You're doing good. Okay, so Sadie, it was one of the reasons why I am doing this live today because I promised Sadie I was going to make Cuban sandwiches because she said she loves them. They're her favorite, favorite, favorite. Also, Emily Sukup loves them. I know some others that they love them who was on my team time. And so, yeah. So, how does it look? It looks amazing. Oh, um, Emily said, I'm laughing so hard. And Nancy Walter Eastman said, Hi. You folks are amazing. Exemplary presentation with a fabulous recipe. Looks we're, delish. We're I love the concept of you two presenting this together. Oh, you're so sweet. You could have your own cooking show. Thank you. Great job. Your lips to. I, I, think, don't know. We, I think we should just put her. Someone's your ears. lips to God's ear. Oh, yeah. I see that. Huh? Well, I don't know if God is really going to support something like this. I think God does support everything we do, as long as it's not it's glorifying to Him. It's, so I don't know if it's true for you. Maybe you were acting a little mean to me. So. Oh, care. gaps! Come on. Wow. I'm not okay. <laughs> I can't not smile. You guys already know that. This is terrible. We're and not going to show my teeth. Yeah, really. Right. It's looking really good. Treva, right. Treva, Treva. Hey, Treva. Okay, should I do the giveaway now? I have. It's looking really good. What do you plan to do with the extra marinade? I don't know if there is any extra now, right? The no, I poured it all on. Yeah, we, we, at the end, we like put it all on. Yeah, I did. I, I'm not sure if and I was And Nancy to said, so yes, I would have like subscribed. Let's see. I might as well just pour it. Yeah. Sadie I mean, awesome. like, fresh marinade, not the one that the raw... <laughs> Sabrina said she'll come help us eat it if we need. I know. It's pretty sweet. Leanne's Shonda good. said, I have had a Cuban sandwich called a mojito, and it's awesome. Really? I keep hearing that they're amazing. So Mona trying. said, this looks easy enough. I can do it myself instead of ordering from Cuba Cuba all the time. Yeah. Isn't true. that something? Yeah. And they're probably, like, way more expensive. Because we probably... We just Emily's a much. ticket for Nancy. Ticket for Nancy. All right. Grill the sandwich cover with the press is six to eight minutes, turning halfway through or until cheese is melted and bread is crisp. Cut the sandwich into pieces, which I'm gonna put it right here after, and then look at our yum. Our potato yum shows. potato straws. Mmm, love them. This is so like. Wait a minute, let me turn it up a little bit. Okay. Okay, so let's do our giveaway. So those of you who guessed I was going to make Cuban sandwiches, you're gonna win. Guess what you're gonna win? Brand new cookbook that has the Cuban sandwich recipe. I, you know, I've been reading all the comments. I've got to read this one. I, what? You know. What? Nancy said, yes, Emily, your parents are extremely talented and very vibrant. Love the show. Aw. So sweet. Ticket oh, for you. Right. <laughs> okay, I here's the winner, winner, chicken dinner. You guys ready? Em said, yes, they crack me up. Love watching this. I feel like I'm there. Penny! Oh, you're here in our heart. Penny. Penny! Is Penny on still? I think so. Penny, 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 Penny. You won, you won, you won, you won. Shauna said, all the more reasons to buy some pampered chefs. Right? Yep. Wow, you're so nice. So I think I think it came out pretty fabulous. So so Penny, you just won. So the I'm going to send you a taste prize. Good, huh? They're like really sweet. I told you. You're like, well, let's make wedges next time. I'm sure that's totally good. Look how young they are. Okay. I know, but the flavor is like. It's salt and pepper pampered chef. Wow. And all the All the Or no? All for all of them. All of them. <laughs> mm -hmm. Penny said, woohoo. Yep, I knew she was there. Hang on, I think it's getting caught in between my gaps. How many minutes is it? I was going to say you could eat an apple through a chain link fence, but that's, bu that's more buck Seriously, teeth. Seriously, 
You should see the stream of water she can spit out through her between. Very shushy. Ooh, look at Is the back burner on? Yeah, just the back one's on, see? Look, it looks like the cheese is melting too. Ooh, See, in my brain, I feel the... like we need two slices of cheese. I don't know. Yeah. Right? Should I put one other one on? No. No? Let's Next batch. <laughs> Should I make another batch? I can't remember. I don't think so. Look it. So we're going to leave it right there and let it ride. Did you say let it ride? Yeah. What? What? Sadie said, put rosemary and sea salt on those taters. Ooh. Well, we did do sea salt. We did do sea salt. Of course, Emily and sea salt. Pamper Chef, and then we did, um, we didn't, we have Pamper Pam Chef. Penny said, no worries, girl, I have that same tooth gap. Thank you. I you think, know, it's, I I think just, it's very I exotic. Just, I've just embraced it over the years, you know? I just, I just totally embraced it. Do any of you know who Seal, the singer, is? Yes. I guess that's a little bit more current than are you Charlie Pride. About, are you talking to, are you asking, look at that. <laughs> are you asking me if I know who Seal is? The new waffle iron can, oops, shh. Huh? Leanne. Leanne. Oh, girl, you have hit it on the nail. <laughs> See, so for this one, let's. I'm saying like smash or oh yeah. So let, for this one, let's do um, let's do cheese on top too. Would that be wrong, Sadie? Sadie's like the connoisseur of of Cuban sandwiches. Just saying. Did she? Is that the one that said she doesn't have to go to Cuba, Cuba anymore? No. I don't know. You're reading it, Cuckoo. I don't. Well, know. I don't. My memory. From one, one room to the next. It, who said who said they don't have to go to Cuba, Cuba anymore? Um. Hey, this is this is all gonna line up too. Mona said that. Oh, Mona. Yeah, Mona lives in California. Look at, where is I'm that? Wh one. What part of California? Mona, tell us where you live. I know you're in California. Oh, she's up. I think she's up north actually. Oh, okay. I think she's up north. Look Emily at. said to tell mom how beautiful. I tell her all the time how beautiful she is. Isn't that one, like once a year? I mean, if it changes, I'll let you know. Wow. I cannot even believe you. <laughs> Seriously. Whatever. Sadie said, no, cheese is good. Yes, okay. cheese good. <laughs> no okay. cheese bad. <laughs> okay, but I just used it all. Now I just need one more. I hate you enough. I think I am. Sadie said, I'm going to love that sandwich. Really? You got to try it, girlfriend. Will this is very person? hard to just sit here and... What? Smell it all and watch Sorry, it. Sorry, I'm going to... You're going to eat it and like... A minute. Mona said she's from San Pedro. No, I know she's but from lives San Pedro. But lives in Denver. That's Denver. Pretty, that's really Northern California. Denver. Why? I don't know what I was thinking, Northern California. Okay, but where's the Cuba Penny place? Penny said what kind of cheese is that? Swiss. Yep, you're right, Swiss. Swiss. What'd you say, what part of Denver? No, I said, oh. what part, where do you go to the Cuba place? Yeah, where's, well, is I'm that sure in Denver. Denver is very international. I don't think that, there's not, there's, I don't know if there's another place like that in San Pedro. I don't remember one, do you? I wouldn't. Sadie said to add more cheese. You did, right? Really? Yeah, I did. See? I See, Sadie, I needed you on here with me. She goes to the restaurant in Denver. Yeah, Denver's oh, like multi... Oh, I mean, they got... Multi multicultural. Yeah. That's where Anthony's from, Denver. Really? Mm-hmm. Did I take the stuff out of this one? <gasps> oh, did I take it out? Oh, wow. No. Are you supposed to take it out? Sadie, is that like a Cuban sandwich or... Do they hollow the bread out and take yeah, over? Yeah, you guys, you guys, the Cuban eaters, Cuban sandwich eaters, not you eat Cuban people. Yeah, right, it's in Denver. Okay. No, but, not in Pedro. 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 She's from Pedro. Yeah. Yeah. People Mona. from Pedro say Pedro. Pedro. Okay, but Mona is Charlene's sister, right? Charlene? Charlene? Yeah. I heard something. We always hear things. I, like to... I know. I hear things too. I Do you guys saying... hear like any like little weird well, like knocks? The, like, Leanne's it... the closest to us. So if Leanne's on still and like all of a sudden live like she could be at the front door and attacks oh. us or something. Yeah. Just, you know. You think she's waiting at the front door? I'm not sure if Prescott please will come, but. Ooh, do I... I M said she's never had a Cuban sandwich. Just a Cuban husband, huh? <laughs> Isn't Matthew Cuban? No. Huh? I don't even know where they would sell them here, so it's perfect to me. I'll tell you, Phoenix, I guarantee you, has a Cuban restaurant. I bet they do. Okay, we're going to put them on here, because I think that's enough It's very time popular. Now. Oh, shoot, shy. And you know what's really cool, you guys? Let me just tell you that you can put metal in this pan. So really and truly... <laughs> I'm saying, are you Cuban? If, I want, to use, if <laughs> I want to use this, it doesn't matter. I'm everything. It doesn't matter. It's not going to scratch the pan. And then I'm going to cut it in half. 
What do you think? Brian? I'm just gonna stay here with the beef, okay? Yeah, it's fine. It's mm -hmm. like you're a short order cook over there, huh? Right. Sadie said, said I wish I was there. Oh, maybe I'm doing it too. I think I do. <laughs> Emily said, Am I? <laughs> Are you Cuban? Just a no, little bit. Oh, shoot. Look what I'm doing. You're Argentinian, I think I made, I think Italian, I too long on that one. half Mexican. Emily's a mutt. That's why she's Shauna oh, said, Have oh. a good night. Oh, thank you. Wait, what time is it? Well, Are you on the East Coast? In the East Coast, it's um, seven right? or six. Yeah, that's nighttime, right? Yeah, that's true. Right? Okay, so. <laughs> Mona said, I never have time to notice if they're hollowed out. They don't last that long. <laughs> they don't last long enough. Okay, so I'm going to. That's like me. It's hot. It's hot. Yeah, I'll use this. That's why I whoop down Big Blue, huh? Big Remember? Blue. Like, I, I eat like a Rottweiler. Okay, I think I'm supposed to, like, diagonally cut it. Wow, I'm that's, those to. are really crispy. Oh, flip them over, huh? Watch your fingers. Well, the thing's red, you'd never. So you're never sure. Oh my goodness, look at this, Brian. It's like chewy, gooey, good. No, here, I'll get the nicer one I cut. Wow. Seriously. Oh, that would have been the good thumbnail thing right there. Right? Yes. Yeah. How do you make it a thumbnail? I think there's a way, actually. Oh, there's a Isn't way. Isn't that look good? Should yeah. we taste it? I think you should. I never taste You never it. taste, but this is friends and family. You know? This is friends just, and family. We don't have to be professional. It's super good. We could just be fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Penny did the, the emoji with the. Hello, Earth, do you want? Are you, are you with us still? Super good. Until next time. <laughs> See you later. You want some? Uh, yeah, I'll get one. Seriously. I don't know what that this gap kind amazing. of diseases that gap has in it. Wow. No, I'm just kidding. This is super amazing. You don't Super need to leave amazing. them on long. Just need to Apparently, melt the cheese. Huh? Yeah, just oh, okay. See, the next time they're going to be restaurant quality. Yeah, it's the first time. We know more cheese. And we know more those. cheese and don't have to just let the cheese yeah. melt. Well, that's what it said in the directions. It said six or eight minutes or until cheese melts. But obviously, our uh, season might, you know, the, the, the oven. Treva, yeah, Treva said drool. I know. If I could even Hopefully, I'm going to turn this drool. Yeah, I would. I'm going to turn this drool into. Just to let you guys know, thank you guys so much for coming in live with us. So it's kind of fun to pop in yeah. on Sundays and and do this um, for just for our friends and family. Super fun and just to show you some new recipes and products stuff like that. Um, if you guys are interested in purchasing any of these products. Holler, holler, let me know what you love or what you might need or want to add to your to your kitchen um, to make these recipes super quick and easy. Or if you want to party with me, guess what? Stoneware is actually a um, special bonus, 60% off this month. So you can get stoned with me, yes, yes, all right? Or if you want to try on the apron, guess what? That's the best thing in the entire catalog is our starter kit. So thank you guys again so, so much. So um, until we eat again, I'm all done.